Good evening. The daughter of a 75-year-old man who was stabbed to death on his way home from evening prayers says she believes it was a premeditated attack. Mohammed Salim was stabbed three times in the back in the small Heath area of Birmingham on Monday night. Today, police released fresh CCTV footage in the hope that witnesses will come forward. Joanne Rittle's report contains some flash photography from the beginning. Daughters of murdered 75-year-old Mohammed Salim make an emotional appearance in front of cameras as the police hunt for the killer who stabbed him three times in the back deepens. As sad and devastated as we all are, it is very difficult for us to accept the brutality of what's happened to our dad. Grandfather, just you never ever in your wildest dreams can imagine something like this can happen. Mohammed Salim was a devout Muslim. These pictures show him being shown around his local mosque during a refurbishment. But it was when he was on his way home from prayers on Monday night that his killer struck, close to his home in Small Heath in Birmingham. Police have now released this CCTV footage of a white man seen running in the area at the time, who they want to trace, and further footage of a people carrier. The man was seen here in Windcliffe Road, close to the murder scene and police say they need to speak to him. The significance of, of him being stabbed in the back and no defence wounds is, is clearly that uh, this was a, a very quick attack, that he had no opportunity to defend himself and that whoever did this clearly intended to inflict very, very serious damage on Mr Saleem. We've had condolences from not only within our community, from all races and backgrounds. Um, our friends have been really supportive. We've had so many tributes come in for him. Flowers lay at the scene where Mohammed Salim lost his life as a community struggled to make sense of the killing. Oh, oh I'm sorry, sir. He, he is my friend. He is my friend. He always been the time in mosque. He is very good person. He was never a man to be out there to harm anyone. He already done every day was. Come, her, come from his house to pray at the mosque, go home. That was it, he was a beloved man. I don't know whoever done, why they done, because he's a lovely man. He, we all times have seen him going to five days of the mosque to pray. He was known as Uncle Salim by many in his community. Police are now trying to piece together why anyone might have wanted to kill him. Joanne Rittle, BBC Midlands Today, Birmingham. Police investigating a major...